Why are the Moody's leaving Carmel Village? They're leaving me. I'm stressing out. I'm panicking. Oh no, oh no, no. Please don't go. What did I do? We're supposed to be friends, a team. Not here. That's impossible. Anything is Harry, possible. Harry, can you hear me? Oh no. Have you left me? Are you leaving me because you don't love me or even like me anymore? Did I say the wrong thing? Or did I say the right thing at the wrong time? Oh, whatever the reason, please don't go. I promise to be better. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. I need to relax. I need to breathe. I'm not feeling well. Oh, I feel bad. I need to lie down. Yes, it's working. She's blaming herself. <laughs> I like it. No, stop it, Agatha. Wake up. Stop feeling bad for yourself. You did nothing wrong. Breathe. <sighs> I can handle it. Just breathe. Slow. Hey, Agatha. I see you're breathing a little despacito. Na, 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 na. Despacito. Oh, yeah. This is a cool song, Garito. I like to eat burritos. I'm having really fun, Garito. I sound awesome, don't I, Rita? <laughs> Phew. Thanks for getting my mind off my worries for a millisecond, Bonnie. But now I'm back to thinking the worst again. Have you seen Harry? I think he's gone. I haven't seen Harry today, but he left this book with me and asked me to pass it on to you. Show me, Bonnie. Please share it with me. Of course, Agatha. Here it is. Oh, wow. It's the Book of Truths. Harry told me about it before. Whatever we need explained, we're bound to find it in a book. It's like magic. Oh, maybe it explains why he's left Carmel Village. Go on, Agatha. What are you waiting for? Open it. Go on. You'll find the answers you're looking for. I want to pretend that he's still around and opening this book of truths will make me face the truth. I'm not ready yet. I miss him so much. What if the book has an invitation to a tropical island? Or a story of a moonwalk trip? Or a portal to a mega slide in an epic world? Oh, oh. Or what if it's a glimpse of an adventure to see friendly dinosaurs in an exotic jungle? Maybe there's a map with the way to go and meet Harry. You're right, Bonnie. It's time to face the music. We need to know once and for all why Harry left and how long he's gone for. Maybe there's a happy ending. Should I stay here with you? Thanks, Bonnie, but this is something I need to do for myself. I'm going to go to the Mushroom Park and read the Book of Truths. I'm ready to find out why Harry left. No problems, Agatha. I understand. It's Queen Bee's birthday soon, and I want to go buzzing around to find a present for her. Any ideas what I could get her? A crown of flowers, cause flowers are the new jewels. <laughs> flowers are the new jewels. That's a good one. Queen Bee will love that. Thanks, Agatha. Buzz you later. Oh, and good luck. Let me know how it goes. Thanks, Bonnie. Talk later. I was brave to fly through a rainbow. Surely I can be brave and open the book of truth. Yep, 
I choose to be brave. Now, where's a good, comfortable spot? Hi, pretty bird. You look lost. Is everything okay? Oh, hi. Nice to meet you. I'm just looking for a nice, cosy spot to read why my friend has left Carmel Village. Are you talking about Harry? Yes, but how did you know that? Oh, it was just a random guess. Hey, you. You better not tell her who I really am. I don't want to see Agatha and Harry ever reunite. <laughs> uh, that's strange, but okay. Harry told me to question everything, but since he's not here, I won't ask how you know. That sounds delightful. You're a wise girl, Agatha. That's what Harry tells me all the time. Hey, how do you know my name? Another wild guess. Would you like to go to my house for some hot chocolate and marshmallows? That sounds delicious. I'm busy right now, though. I'm going to read the Book of Truths and find out where Harry is and why he left without saying goodbye. Yes, that sounds like a very important thing for you to do. But you must not do it on an empty stomach. I baked fresh bread and marmalade. It will go beautifully with the yummy hot chocolate. I suppose Harry would want me to fuel my body. Of course he would, dear. Okay. Now, you sit there, my love. Thanks. I never asked you your name. I'm Hate. I mean, I'm Kate. I thought I heard you say you're Hate. <laughs> Hi, Kate. Yeah, I suppose I'm Kate with the H. <laughs> now, dearest, let me take that book so you can eat comfortably. Hey, you! Do not comment below to tell her that I've replaced the Book of Truth with the Book of Lies. <laughs> mm, this was delicious. The last time I was here in the abandoned mansion, I had a nightmare that everyone was the same. The link is in the description for anyone who wants to watch Nightmare in Carmel Village. Oh, the world would be a much better place filled with hate. I, I mean, Kate. <laughs> Thank you so much, Kate, with a H. I feel more ready than ever to read the Book of Truths. Bye. Bye, dear. And enjoy the Book of Lies. I mean, the Book of Truth. <laughs> Here it goes. I'm ready. Uh, hi, Agatha. Oh, hi, Frank. I was just about to read the Book of Truths. W was it my imagination? Or did I just see you coming from that abandoned mansion? You sure did. I was there with Kate. With a H. Oh, no. Not hate. She's really scary. And mean. No, she's not, Frank. Kate with a H is so nice. Kate with the H is hate. Frank, do you think someone who hates me would bake me fresh bread and marmalade? I don't think so. Uh, Agatha, just because a person appears to be nice on the outside doesn't necessarily mean they're nice on the inside. Listen to your gut. Oh, what's that in your hand, Agatha? It's the Book of Truth. Harry left it for me. Please tell me that hate didn't touch it. Yes, Frank. Kate, not hate kept it safe for me while I devoured my frothy hot chocolate. It was so yummers. Oh no, oh no, oh no. This is a disaster. You had her hot chocolate? 
And she took the book of truth from you that Harry left you? There you go again. Being worried about stupid things as usual. Maybe you should be worried that Harry left? I'm more worried about the book you have in your hands right now. I, I sense danger from it. Oh, stop it already, Frank. I've had enough. You sense danger from everything. I'm going to start reading it by the trampoline of ups and downs. Don't! Watch me. Next Wednesday on the Moody's. I'm trapped in the Dungeon of Lies! Help! I, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Please remember that just because a person appears to be nice on the outside doesn't mean they're nice on the inside. Yes, people have to earn our trust over time. Do you think Agatha should trust Kate with a H? Comment below, we'd love to know. And don't forget to subscribe. And make sure you ring that bell. Ding, ding, ding. See you later, guys. Yeah, we-